Hey guys, it's Ann over at Plant Obsessed, and today we're going to take a look in on the African night crawlers that are in these black totes. Alright, well as you can see over here, I may have flipped that corn over, but it is still growing. So let's take a closer look in and see what they're doing in here with these corn. It's really growing a, a plant here. It's crazy. You see the worms in there. It still has the, the skin on and everything. But they're just eating down into the, the husk and whatever didn't get damaged last time is it's sprouting now. Alright, so let's dig around in the bin and see what's going on. I did put more bedding on top to try and keep them from wandering. Seems to be working. I'm not finding any worm jerky around the room. So let's look and see what's going on a little deeper. It's kind of dry. Okay. This was wet bedding, so I'm a little surprised to see it so dry underneath. Also not seeing much in a whole lot of worms. Nope. Another avocado tree for me. So I am seeing some worms, but Certainly not my typical, I don't know why, it is awfully dry, we're going to have to do something about that. Oh, another avocado tree. Alright, so let me look over into this next bin here. And it looks like it's doing about the same, so I'm going to have to add a lot of moisture to this. Seasons are changing around here already, so looks like it's oh, looks like my helper's back. But it looks like I'm going to need to add quite a bit more moisture. Looks like they're going through this bedding quite a bit. Looks like this bin is eating its corn and is moving on to the bedding for the most part. Oh, here's the corn. It was buried underneath all of the, the bedding. Okay, so I am going to put you down, and then I'm going to get the food and the spray bottle, and we'll be right back. Okay, so today I'm going to bury this corn back underneath and give them another little bit of a feeding. I've got my coffee and paper and some fruit, some bananas from work, give them about a third of that, and then I'm going to really spray them down. This is much, much, much too dry.
Okay, I'll move on to the next one now. Okay, so I think we're going to start by digging a bit of a pit for that corn to put that corn back in. Right there, flip that over again. And then put some more of the coffee and fruit on top of that. And then make sure I water that in quite a bit. Put some of the bedding over. This is a one liter sprayer and I'm probably going to have to refill it. I filled it just a bit ago, but these guys are super dry so yeah they really need the, the moisture. This is way too dry for them. Would have been ideal to have had a, a wet feeding, but we get what we get. All right, now on to the last of the three bins. All right, well, I can't find the other piece of corn. All I'm finding is this. I could have swore there was a corn in every one of these. But we're just going to make a trench for the new food since I can't seem to find the other corn. The rest of the, the rest of the new food in here. And then get my sprayer ready. This should help a lot. That paper, although it was dry, it was moist bedding when I put it in here. It was not enough apparently to keep this area wet here. So I'm going to go get a refill and you don't need to see that. Spring water is boring. But I uh, wanted to let you take a look in on the African night crawlers and what they've been up to. Alright guys, well, if you like the video, give me a muddy thumbs up, and if you're not already a member of my worm family, click that subscribe button, and if you want to know what I'm doing when I'm doing it, ring that little bell icon. Alright guys, thanks for hanging out with me and my worms, and everybody, have a good day.